Hey guys, welcome back to Jamaica Chop Shots. Today, we are excited to introduce something new, audio commentary. This is the first in a series where we'll be giving you detailed insights on Jamaica's landmarks and we plan to keep this going in some of our future videos. If you have been following our channel, you'll remember we recently covered the entire path of the Montego Bay Bypass, starting in Iron Shore and ending in the vicinity of Bog. Today, we are zooming in on a vital part of that project, a bridge that's not only essential, but also one of the most expensive components of that project. Stay tuned while we give you an aerial tour and more information on this bridge. This bridge, said to become Jamaica's tallest bridge, will measure 108 meters in length and stand over 30 meters high. It is being built to support four lanes of traffic, which will also make it the longest four-lane bridge in the country. Positioned to allow the bypass to cross the Montego River, it also spans a minor roadway below, connecting different parts of Montego Bay with ease. As can be seen, this beam bridge is being constructed primarily with concrete and reinforced steel. The structure rests on 15 massive piers or columns, each anchored deep into the ground 
to provide the stability needed for a bridge of this magnitude. These columns act as the main support system holding up the heavy horizontal beams that stretch across the span of the bridge. The beams are not just regular concrete, they are carefully engineered to manage tension and compression forces. This design should ensure the bridge handles heavy loads, allowing it to support the constant flow of vehicles expected once the bypass is fully operational. We are pretty excited to see how this marvel of engineering stands the test of time and the tropical climate of Jamaica. As we fly over this section, you can see the horizontal concrete and the steel beams, the very backbone of this bridge. Each of these beams is manufactured here on site with precision engineering to ensure they'll withstand both the weight of traffic and the natural forces of tension and compression.
Below, you'll notice the red metal beam launchers, essential for transporting these massive beams to their final positions on the bridge. These launchers lift and carefully guide the beams from the staging area to the bridge structure, helping to secure each one perfectly in place on the supporting piers. It's incredible to see this process unfold from above as every piece plays a vital role in making this bridge Jamaica's tallest and the longest four-lane bridge. The combination of concrete, steel, and innovative technology brings this project to life, one beam at a time. Thank you for joining us on this tour of one of Jamaica's most ambitious construction projects. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to Jamaica Tune Shots for more stunning views and insights on the places shaping our island's future. We'll see you in the next video.